morning. Oh man, that seems loud. Hold on, let me adjust that a little bit. I, I'm almost clipping. I turned it up for somebody last the other day, and, uh, audio, and now I feel like I'm like screaming in your ear. I look over and it it, it literally just tipped the, tapped the red when I said good morning. Ah, how is everybody today? Charity, first one in here, of course, usually is. Uh, what's up, Savage, Michigander, brother? Let's go. Mitten State, Mitten State for the win. <clears throat> Man, when I said I'd keep you at my out for live stream. <laughs> yeah, you know, I was sitting here and I was I, I was making the thumbnail for, because I, I knew I was going to go live playing this game next. And I was making the thumbnail, and uh, you know, I said, "Screw it! I got a, I got a couple hours. Let's, let's just do it now. Let's go live for now, right now. We'll knock out the tutorial." I, I, I it took me a bit to, to, uh, God, is it me or does anybody else that, that plays PC enough and wants to delete a save file get irritated when there is no like just general location that all save files go like this game has its own location uh, a majority of the games go into documents and there's a it, it just it generates a file in there under either the dev name or the game name and you open it up and you just delete the file it's not that hard why don't they all do that why can't they just like okay let's all put it right there let's put the same file right there the game will draw from that pot spot no problem no you gotta freaking dive in deep and uh, do some Google searching and find where people po or where where people say it is, and hope they're right. <laughs> so I wiped it, and uh, we're starting from scratch. Um, I did open it up just to make sure things were all right, and it, 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 it's running. So I, I I won't be opening it up, and it won't be in, in like Swahili or anything like that. So I will be able to <laughs> I will be able to take right off. Um, uh, the only thing. I can't, I can't like start from the beginning and play without Hunter Sense. Like I want to play the expert mode, um, but it won't let me uh, unless I uh, do it. Um, unless I play through the tutorial first. So I got to play through the tutorial using Hunter Sense, Hunter Sense, and then I'll probably back out and switch it to the expert mode because I kind of want to play just hardcore. You know, I want to play a true hunting style. See how that goes. I might get irritated with it and switch it back, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I just had fun making fun of Fisk and telling him that I play it on Expert and he plays it on Hunter Sense. So we'll see. <laughs> uh, mama, mama, she will be... Oh, yeah, all good, all good. I mean, I mean, when it comes to mods, I mean, it's all volunteer work, and I appreciate the fact that people want to do a mod for me. So I, I never expect anybody to be here. Like, if I can't be here, I'm not going to complain. But, you, know, you know, it's not a job. You know, it's just uh, yeah, extra responsibility, and uh, you're not getting paid for it. So I appreciate the willingness to do so. so uh, do what you need to do. IRL first, for sure, always. <clears throat> uh, da -da -da -da, blonde coffees. Uh, see, no beer today, though. I'm not having my blonde ale. This not this early. I will be drinking later. Uh, meeting up with some friends uh, this afternoon. To do do some uh, do some drinking, so we'll see how well that goes. That's out away from home too, so I'm I won't be drinking too much because I will have to drive home. But it'll be over the course of a handful of hours. So we're gonna dive into some quality beers because this is a buddy of mine. We're going to I go to have a buddy of mine that he he gets a lot of a lot of hard to get beer. His beer cellar is insane. My beer cellar is local. <laughs> I have a lot of beer, but it's all local, um, or Michigan or stuff. But you know, I, I don't, I don't, I don't do the beer trading stuff like my buddies do on, on Facebook. They, they, they dive, they dive in deep. <clears throat> uh, let's see, Queens, hi, uh, Nate, hello, Eleanor, how's it going? Welcome. Who else? Olaf, of course. The very sexy bearded Olaf. He's I don't know if you know who Olaf is. You should check him out on uh, on his Twitch channel. He's he's been streaming a lot lately. Lately, he got a new PC and he's been he's been hitting it hard. He's uh he's a very fancy man. 
with a sexy beard and an awesome accent. He's got the he's got even more of a Swedish accent than Fisk. Because he, he'll say yump instead of jump. He hits his J's with a Y. Like a pro Swede. Unlike uh, Fisk. Fisk is a fake Swede. <clears throat> I'm a little quiet. What? No, no, you're saying I'm quiet? I'm I'm literally, I'm almost clipping still. God dang it. <clears throat> I'm, I, I'm screaming here too. I'm sure. I'm, I'm surprised my wife hasn't come downstairs. Like, Why are you freaking so loud again? <laughs> Cause I, I I'm loud, I'm yelling in my mic. <clears throat> I don't know. That's I don't know. I, I base it all off of whatever my my streamlabs is uh, yeah telling me. So <clears throat> so I apologize if I'm quiet to you. Maybe you should just turn me up. <laughs> when I drank, I remember visiting uh Montana st strictly for beer. They used to have most uh microbreweries per capita. Montana. Are you sure? How long ago was this? Because uh, uh, when it comes to craft beer brewery, uh, like uh, ranked, it'd be like Colorado, uh, Oregon, um, California, and Michigan are the top four when it comes to like volume of craft beers. Um, Montana doesn't even come close to ranking there. <laughs> I don't know about nowadays, but oh, that's crazy. Cause what Montana has what Big Sky Brewing, right? That that's a, that's a great beer, really great beer. Uh, what is that? Uh, Moose Drool. That's fantastic. I love Moose Drool. Ears are damn near bleeding. See, Shane. Turn 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 me up. Turn me up. Everybody else, I'm I'm blowing out the eardrums because I'm hitting my bees with that bass, extra b -b bass. Oh look who it is. Booster has joined. Booster just comes for the hot tub. He always sent. He always DMs me saying, "Let's just let's just get into a VC and we'll stare at your hot tub, hot tub, you know, overlay, and we'll just look at you." <laughs> no lie, no lie. I would never tell fibs, but I'm not gonna chat too long today. We're gonna jump into the game because I only have a couple hours. Then I gotta then I gotta go get around, go to the store. I want to pick up some beers from uh, a local place. Uh, that way I'm not walking into this guy's place without anything. Because, like I said, his beer cellar just takes, it, it, you know, it sets the, the standard. It sets the bar. It's insane. He always makes me feel bad. They all do, actually. Because, like I said, they do the beer trading shit. I don't bother with that garbage. It's, it's, it's just too much work. Then I got to go to UPS, ship it off, label it as... God, you're always complaining. What are you what always. What are you doing in here? <laughs> Everybody say hi to Fooster. I popped in for a minute, dude, just so I can check your audio. Uh, yeah. can you talk to me a sec? Testing one, two, test, 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 test. Okay, you are a little bit quiet through OBS. That's what the problem is. You were I have to max volume you in order to get a good amount of audio out of you. Okay. So that's what people are saying. Test, um, test, you're test. Fine through Discord, it comes in on OBS. Okay. Uh, but you're fine for today, so don't worry about it. You're 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 audible, like so. Oh, I'm audible. Okay, okay, okay. Cool. Yeah. So uh, I'll I'll, I'll fiddle with that then. I just turned it up a little bit more. Now I am clipping on there. According to OBS, I'm clipping. What do you mean clipping? You're going into the red. You should going... be just touching into the red, by the way. Ooh, I should be just touching the red. <laughs> I, I I'm actually halfway up now. I was literally just touching earlier, and that's where I didn't want to get beyond that. But I am popping right, in there now. We'll, we'll do then. We'll when you've got some time. Uh, over the week, we'll we'll go through all your settings and stuff, and we'll root all your audio properly. But it's absolutely fine for now. It is just a little bit quieter than usual. It's because me and the Swede are really loud. So <laughs> true. I gotta turn crap down. I'm, I I always try to stay below you two because you two are the entertainment. I'm just the the back seat. Oh, sitting next to you. He goes like, make sure your audios are quieter than mine. Talent. That's what that's what happens every time. They're like, all right, Taco, t t speak for us, and then they turn me down, turn me down. No, speak again. They're like, on your, what was it? We're riding on your coattails, Taco. Oh gosh, yeah, right. <laughs> me and my almost two thousand subscribers on YouTube. Yeah, Let's go. Know, Congratulations, that's fucking awesome. Yep, I'm gonna, I'm, uh, I'm gonna put up merch, two thousand club. <laughs> <laughs> the 2k club all right i'm gonna dip you because i got a lot of editing to do but i'll be lurking so have a fun stream and yep. enjoy some uh some more way of the hunter Look yep sounds good chat. talk to you right, bye -bye. <clears throat> i 
Everybody say bye to Fooster. Appreciate him. Always appreciate him. All right, let's uh, let's get this game going. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I did make some adjustments on the game too because it blew my eardrums out when uh, I I played like the animated thing. There was an animated part. I don't know how many people played the um, story yet, and that's actually what made me think I should probably get before I dive in too deep. This is what I'm gonna do, so I don't want to get any farther in the story. So I erased uh, my save file. So this may be blowing. I don't know. We'll see. Switch the game. And uh, let's uh, stop Fisk's music. Also, if you're wondering what my, my opening scene music is and all that, my closing scene, it's Fisk Beats. Check them out. Whatever whatever. if you do. Uh, I, 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 if you're one of those iPhone people, uh, shame on you, number one. But also hey, YouTube, anything. Uh, you know, he's he's everywhere. It's Fisk Beats. Check him out. There's a lot. There's he's got a lot in there now, and he's added more. A little bit for every occasion. It's fantastic. <clears throat> third wheel, yes. Charity, I am. They 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 refer to me as uh, Third Wheel Taco. That's what they call me. No lie. They're like, oh, Third Wheel's here. Let's go. Let's. Uh, we need to turn him down a little bit though. <laughs> Thank you. Ooh, Link Tree, Fisk Beats. Thank you. Oh. Sh uh, Olaf, uh, do me a favor, uh, DM me that link so I can add it to my description. Uh, because I just said check out Fist Beats in the description. I didn't realize there's a link tree. Uh, I want to make sure I keep that in the description. Because I utilize it and uh, I bring it up, but I, I thought I had it in the description, but I didn't. Or not the link tree, but something else. Done. Thank you very much, dude. Appreciate it. <clears throat> All right. So once again, we have to use Hunter Sense in the tutorial. So we're gonna jump in and do this thing, and then once we do, once we knock out the tutorial, then we'll switch back and we'll we'll jump back and we'll turn it to uh, the most difficult mode because pro hunter here. <clears throat> Tiger, hello, welcome in. Did you see they tweeted a roadmap to this game? No, I did not. I'll have to check that out. Well, I'll definitely have to check that out because there is some needed things for this game for sure. Um, one of them being better <laughs> multiplayer. The multiplayer, the game is fantastic solo so far. From what little I played, I love it solo. Uh, but um, multiplayer is borderline garbage. Uh, you know, it, so the devs really need to put some work into that. If, I, if we're gonna, probably, if we're gonna ever put any more multiplayer in, I'm, to be honest, there's too many, there's too many issues with it, and they need like competition stuff. That's me. Look at me with my fancy. I can't, I wish I could grow a beard that thick. My beard grows in so garbage. Plus, I got, I got the salt and pepper. Grandpa. Call him Grandpa. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? The service in the valley is really bad, so I'll make it quick. I sent you a package a day ago, but I'm not sure when it will arrive. Just make yourself... Thanks, Olaf. Maybe greet your old friend Echo. You know, it's been a while. Oh, God, I forgot about that. How long has it been? Ten years. I hope you didn't forget the key. Oh, God, I did. What should I do? 
Um. All right, I'm here. I'll call you later. And see this is a badass place. I would love to have a place like this. Welcome to the Nispers Valley. Little bit of chat here while that while that was playing. I didn't want to speak over it too much. Bought it yesterday, so I'm excited to work on a solo as well. Uh, I don't have many friends. But play, I don't have many friends either. You know, when Fisk and Fooster and I play together, they got to re-add me as a friend every time because they always delete me. <laughs> no lie. <laughs> no, it's it. You know, honestly, uh, it, it plays fantastic. Uh, mullet. Um, it plays fantastic uh solo so uh hopefully hopefully they they work on the, the multiplayer um a little bit to, that way uh, it's more enjoyable because that's where i think call of the wild has them beat right now but solo play this is uh way better than call of the wild when it comes to the storyline and all that it's way way better it's, it, it's more in depth so far, and I didn't even get that deep. I didn't even get that far into it. I decided to start from scratch with you guys. Hey, Tiger's my first stream with you. How you doing? Welcome in, Watchdog. Doing well, doing well. Look at this place. Um, a, a place in Canada that I go. It's called Camp Anjigami up uh, north of Michigan, near Wawa, Canada. Um, their main lodge looks. I want to say it doesn't look like this, but it looks similar to this. Freaking beautiful place. I love it. That's where we go. We go we go up there. It's a friend of mine that owns the place. and uh, It's fantastic. So cool. So cool up there. So secluded. If, if you're looking for a place to check out, you know, Camp and Jigami. Look at me. I'm going to actually I'm gonna hit them up. Say, I just advertised your place. Send me, send me some dollar dollar bills, y'all. <laughs> Can't wait to get a copy of this game. Should have it Monday. Nice. Nice. Yeah, it's fun. It's fun. Solo is really fun. Can't hear the game sounds. Oh, yeah, I can turn the game up a little bit. Let me turn the game up. Um, let's see. Game. I turned it way down for myself. And then I turned the audio, other audio down. So, uh, let's see. Audio. Master volume. Crank that up. That's just 60. There we go. Now, um, my GPU can handle the game. Uh, my CPU is a little bit older, but it still should be able to handle the game. But there's some issues I've noticed. So I do have, like, most of my settings are set to medium for this. It seems to run better, a lot better. So, I mean, But that comes standard with a lot of new games that come out. And then, like when they start making changes and stuff or tweaking stuff, and then then I'll, then, then I usually I can crank them up to high, but uh, for whatever reason, yeah, it's just it's too grainy. It had a lot of granule looks to it with uh, when I had it on high, so I found that uh, it actually looks cleaner at medium. And it looks looks at what it should be on high. <clears throat> Sam, I need a fancy log cabin and a wood, <laughs> right? Oh. I, we have a wood carver that lives nearby, um, and, and uh, actually, I tore down, I cut down a tree. I wanted him to, I was gonna have him do a totem for me, but I I, I, then I looked and saw prices on his website, and I'm like, no, never mind. <laughs> I was just gonna have him put on the face like our our address and keep it that simple, you know. But yeah, he's he's quite expensive, quite expensive. And naturally, so I'm as an artist, right? And something I couldn't do by any means. Wait, you have friends? That's now a Fooster. Well, I, they, they, pre yeah, I, I don't. Oh, damn it. Keys. It's a safe place to put the key, you know? Because, okay, 
little spoiler. It comes a little bit, not very far into the story. It's early, early. The grandpa states that how he does not trust the U.S. mail or doesn't trust the postal service, and yet he puts the keys in the mailbox. Does that make sense? Does that make sense to you? I mean, if the the, the last person I'm going to trust is the mail person, they pull up and be like, oh, keys, let's, let's check out this place. What the heck, Grandpa? See now, Grandpa. <clears throat> Poke! Welcome him in. <clears throat> All right, let's open this. Let's open this up. Hey, take care of a home. Oh, dude, I don't like this Montana. What's up with Montana? Everybody's bringing up Montana lately. Damn. Uh. I only got to go once. His conditions didn't let him travel much. Oh, that sucks. sucks. I, that'd be horrible have, have to be, or be, have uh, like ailments like that. Let's see, equip. Um, I don't think we can equip anything else right now. Yeah, because we got to get the other weapons or the other weapon from the shop. So we have a couple for free. <clears throat> Uh, let's see. My grandpa lived in Montana, or in the mountains. He had to go. Oh, so he had a PO box, basically. Yeah. A lot of places don't. Yeah, a lot of uh, they've uh, they have to go to the. Yeah, mail isn't gonna be delivered out there because it's not. It doesn't. It costs way too much, right? Um, I'm not gonna read through all this. So if you want to read through it, you know, pause, pause, read it. Because I'm just not going to read through. I'll read through this one right though. I think the subject says it all. Your cruel hobby devastated my wife, and I don't want the same thing to happen to my son. He is oh, so this is Richard Knox. This is dad, I think. Uh, yeah, this is dad. He has his own life, a career out um, in L.A. He's only helping you out to out of pity. See, dad is an a hole, and you'll find that out a little bit later. Dad is a big old douche nugget. <laughs> <laughs> He's a jerk. All right, let's go to shopping. Let's uh, uh, I don't think we can buy anything, but we should have some free guns here. Owned. Oh wait, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta knock out some tutorial stuff here before we can actually get the weapons that we have access to. That's right. Okay, reach the northwest balcony on the second floor. So this was what Fisk brought up in his live stream. Basement still locked. Been a mystery since 2002. 2002. So we wonder what what what. So maybe actually Dad has uh, like knows something, and that's why he doesn't want me here. Because the basement's still locked. Because Grandpa has Been a mystery since 2002. Has a secret. Has a dirty little secret he keeps in his basement. God, this place is beautiful. I'm going to turn that down a little bit. Uh, da, 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 da. Head bobbing's off. That's another thing. People say they get motion sickness with this. Turn head bobbing off. Controls. That's what it is. Look sensitivity. Vertical. Look sensitivity. Horizontal. All right. Let's turn these down a little bit. Those reset themselves. Still a little high. Controls. Or no. Controls. Oh, that's too low. There we go. That feels better. <clears throat> Binoculars are our hunter's best friend. First cycle through the gear. And it has basic controls. Right click. One thing they do need to add. It's early game, but you know, is uh, key binding because uh, I want to hit M for map, and that doesn't do jack. All right, close. End that. I get it. There we go. Use the binoculars and glass highlighted checkpoints. Leading you to Echo. Okay. Boop. The bridge. And then the Echo. I wish you could just tab and close that to the little information thing. 
You learn about Echo a little bit later too, and what 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 it means to you. Taco, what's your uh, favorite old movie like before the '90s? Spaceballs. 100% Spaceballs. If you have your, you know, ludicrous speed comes from Spaceballs. <laughs> 100% Spaceballs. Great, great movie. Freaking Star Wars knockoff. So good. All right, here's the map. You've discovered. You've discovered. <laughs> I love how he talks. For beginners and You've discovered. Alike. The meadows serve as prime feeding areas for both pheasants and badgers. Undisturbed grasslands with tall grass have the potential to hold a lot of small, but also some bigger game. Like how big? Like Mufon big? Not in this place. Did, you, did everybody know that Mufon is a sheep? <laughs> I, I should have known that, but I said goat, and then I got yelled at in chat, and then so Fisk naturally just started calling him goat because he's a he's a troll, <laughs> a troll to chat, just like me. <laughs> yeah, that was too good. All right, enter your car. One thing about this also, I, like I I don't I can't tell if I'm walking or running sometimes because you walk so fast. And so I'll tap it. So there's little things like I think the walk should be a little bit slower. And then maybe maybe the creep should be a little bit faster because it's super. This is creep. And then this is walk. And then this is run. Run is a good space. Could pay, could pace. But I think walk could be a little bit slower and creep should be a little bit faster. Just a little bit. Just a tweak. Because walk and, and and run are pretty close to identical. There's it just doesn't feel. Maybe the head bob helps a little bit if I had head bob on, but I it, it I don't like it on. Taco is the no. I'm not a troll. I'm not a troll. I've never been a troll in my life. <laughs> Let me know if game's too loud. I did turn it up for people. Um. I know the vehicle's the water is loud. Wee wee! <laughs> I honked the horn and then I, so I let my finger off, my my D my D key. Fisk is not a troll, neither is my poor sweet princess taco. Thank you, mullet. Yes, I'm uh, yeah, I'm a princess. No game is not loud. All right, perfect. Good, good. The eighties of Sony movies, uh, in Little China. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes, we were talking about that. Smeg, uh, buddy Smeg, and myself we were talking about that because well, we were. Because if you ask Proto. If you know what Proto is, Proto's one of the good guys. Uh, check out our Discord, discord.gg forward slash the good guys. Uh, you'll find all the content creators that are part of the good guys in there. Uh, but Proto, Proto, not being an 80s boy, he's like, a, he's, a, he's a true millennial. So he says all 80s movies are garbage. You know, Beverly Hills Cop. Um, he just, he's, he thinks they're all garbage, right? Little China. He's just he thinks they're just junk, and they're not. They're fantastic. But uh, like Spaceballs, one of the greatest movies of all time, in my opinion, right? But when uh, my kids were going to daycare, still, so it was a long time ago. They were little, and uh, they used to watch Spaceballs like crazy in the back of the in back of the van uh, on their little DVD player, and. Uh, they could word it. They could uh, speak it out verbatim as the scenes came up because they just watch it over and over again. <laughs> nothing, but nothing beats having a having a, having a four year old say, "I'm surrounded by assholes." <laughs> so you feel bad as a parent, but when it's when they're quoting a fantastic movie, it's it's worth it. It's worth it. And then we got, but it gives the opportunity as a parent too to explain to them that 
there's naughty words and stuff like that, right? You, there's you know, there's there's situations that you never say that you never even quote that. <laughs> so in my opinion, it's one of those things you t you it's a teaching opportunity. Old movies beat most of it. Well, you know, in all honesty, a lot of new movies are based off of old movies, right? Or they're remakes of old movies. And, and uh, you know, there are some great new movies, too. And you can't beat CGI, right? But, uh, you know, in the 80s, you're limited. You didn't have CGI in the 80s, right? So the, the things they were able to do it, 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 with forced perspective and... um. You know, just just little tricks of the trade. It's it's in it's insane, it, and it's so cool. You know, clay the claymation stuff. It's it might look choppy. You look at it now, and you're like, ugh. But back in the day, it was you know that was high tech, and that was you know it took a lot of time, a lot of patience, and a lot of know how. It's impressive stuff. Aliens, Adventures of Babysitting, uh, Goonies, Goonies. Oh, I just watched Goonies the other day. Freaking love it. Ghostbusters, Indiana Jones, yeah, Terminator, eight, yeah, exactly, yes. And they're either making sequels or remakes. You know, the Karate Kid. You know, they're still making rando Karate Kids, right? I don't know when the last one was, but what was it the with uh, Will Smith's kid? All right. So those of you who watched Fisk's uh, video on this and commented in his in his comments, actually, do me a favor, Olaf, po post a link to uh, um, Fisk's video, his tutorial playthrough video, will you please? And uh, uh, do me a favor, jump in his in his comments and say, "Where's the beef?" Because he he missed an opportunity of yelling that right there, right? So th throw a comment. Be sure to give him a like. And if, you, if you're not already, which I'm sure you probably are, uh, subscribe to him. Because uh, he's great. He's, 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 he's tearing it up. He's freaking really tearing it up on YouTube. I, I love it. I love his content. Funny dude. You all know who Fisk is. All right. We're heading back. I'm not actually. Okay. So forgive me because I'm not like jumping into the lore and reading every little thing. This is more tutorial anyways. Once we get into the main game, I'll do a little bit. I'll do more of it. But. I'm not, you know, unless it has something to do with grandpa. This this is just, you know, mostly teaching teaching garbage. Garbage. I've been on a recent John Wayne binge. Oh, I've never watched maybe I've like caught like snippets of John Wayne movies, but I've never watched a whole John Wayne movie that I know of. Cause that's even that's even before my time, right? That's and I'm old. <laughs> um, I've never really been a Western, uh, maybe modern Westerns, like, uh, you know, Django Un uh, Unchained, you know, that's oh, so good. But, uh, um, but no, nah, like Westerns, I haven't really, really, I never really was into those. Like that was, that was more like 50s kids, right? 40s kids. Where's the beef, right? Yep. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Please spam that in his comments under that under that uh, video. Uh, I'm kind. Of, I'm watching, looking at the game, but I'm also kind of just glancing at chat. So if uh, if I miss your um, your comment, uh, I apologize. I'm kind of just kind of looking and. Seeing if there's anything directed more towards me. Because I know you guys are talking to each other, which is great. There's Hunter Sense turned on. We won't have that later. Visit the hunting range to hone in your shooting skills. Actually, I could have fast traveled there, I think. Well, we'll drive there, though. 
We'll drive there. We'll go for a cruise. Maybe we'll hit a deer. I love westerns. Like I, uh, I get called old by a fellow. It, dude, yeah. I mean, if you love them, if it's your cup of tea, fantastic. I, I just, yeah. I, in all honesty, I, I just never gave him a chance. Um, if I uh, started watching one, I'm sure I could get caught up in the storyline and all that, just like anything else. Hello, fellow Michigander. Alana, welcome in. So, so, let me, t and let me ask you this. Michigan or Michigan State? Hmm? Hmm? Michigan or Michigan State? That is the question. Am I going the right way? I think I may have missed my turn. I did miss my turn. I was supposed to turn up there. We're going off roading, boys. Oh, it's Noosk. Oh, I didn't even realize. Welcome in, Noosk. So if it's Noosk, that means, oh, I don't follow sports. I'm too fancy. For those of you who don't know Noosk, Noosk has multiple homes all over the state of Michigan. <clears throat> she has her, uh, uh, like her, her summer home on, on the lake, and then her other summer home on the lake. <laughs> She's very fancy. <clears throat> Michigan all day. Thank you, Tiger. Yes. Michigan all day. Go blue. Wolverines. Amen. Multiple homes. Yes. Very fancy. She'd be like, oh, I'm at my weekend cottage right now. She always rubs it into like mine and Proto's face. Oh, what are you guys doing? Oh, we're playing our game. Oh, oh I don't really care. I'm too busy doing my own thing. <laughs> no lie. A mansion for every day of the week. Yes. See? She stopped arguing with us. <laughs> let me get my dong Fifi. Oh, I'm going to let her outside. Oh, and then she'd be like, snap her fingers. Jeeves, let Fifi out. <laughs> so I had to snap my fingers because my bell broke. <laughs> All right, I'm done picking on news. Sorry, news. All right, uh, Ziri rifle while aiming through the scope. Adjust a uh, distance to 50. 4.68. Okay, this one's a 54.68. Okay, let's, uh, boop. Boop. Uh, and we'll, we'll zoom down. Da, 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 da. All right. Bullseye. That would be a good shot. That would be a good shot. My dad would be pissed. And then uh, do a 164. That one's 100, so we want that one out there. Yes, it is. That is way too far for a safe deer shot. Way, way too far. Taco sounds jealous. I, Chris, I am 100% jealous. I mean, wouldn't you want fancy home? Wouldn't you want a multiple fancy homes, I should say. All right. Uh, what's next? What's next? Hit deer targeted 218. Holy, holy hell. And that one's way the hell out there, I think. Yeah. So let's, uh, let's zero to 18. Too low. Nailed it. Let's get the note. It's right here. Hey, Wallace. Name's Taco. Oh, 
Oh, <laughs> funny dude. Funny dude. Oh, let's see. escape. All right, so we gotta go take care of the badgers. Yes, we do. Because go blue, right? None of this Wisconsin badger crap. Am I right? Am I right? Wolverines are the better weasel. Even the MSU Spartans will agree with that. All right, we're going to walk up there. Driving's handy to get A to B quick. But frankly, I just don't like listening to the engine. Just, you yeah. know. I'd rather walk. It's chill. When walking, I can actually read chat too a little bit. Go blue. There you go, Jesse. Go blue. About to hire servants for my ser uh, servants. <laughs> my assistant's assistant. <laughs> this is this is Steve. He's my assistant. This is Diane, my assistant's assistant. <laughs> oh, we got to go up in there before we can actually accomplish what we need to. Another thing I, I like about Call of the Wild is clicking middle mouse button to remove uh, the scope. I wish there was a quick uh, release or quick removal of the scope and to switch to iron sight. Um, you can't even do it, I don't think, in here. Uh, inventory. So, yeah, yeah, you can't even remove it from here. Um. So yeah, because what you know, like hunting these guys, they're all they're all gonna be close range. I'd rather do iron sight. ADSing down a scope is unnecessary. So many burrows. That's unusual. So many burrows. So those of you who are wondering. Uh, and then have been asking for for years now if I if I do videos if I was gonna do videos these will be my videos. Um, I have no plans to actually record and edit videos. Um, I'm not very good at not talking to chat or not talking to somebody. Uh, I I I've I tried, I tried a few recordings and I just I can't keep up a conversation with myself. <laughs> I'm just not good at it. So I'll find myself playing for an hour and then realize I didn't say jack squat. What are we zeroed in at? We need to zoom in. Stop moving. Tango down. Now that wasn't an ethical shot, chat. You know why? Because I did not wait for it to stop moving. You know, you should never take a shot on a moving target. But I did it anyways, because it's a video game. Taco down. Paint. Not taco down. That'd be horrible. That wouldn't be good. <laughs> Are there quads? No, it's just the Jeep. Just the Jeep. <clears throat> but at least you can get two people in it. That was always the thing that we wanted from Call of the Wild, right? All right, let's see how, how we did here. Oh, I gut shot at it. Oh, no, I right lunged it. Okay. Where's the stomach at? That You'd think that maybe the stomach sits a little bit lower and I just bypassed it because it didn't say anything but hitting the stomach. Overview. Trophy rating one. Hunter rating. Nice. All right, we'll take it. We'll text the dreamy. Oh, we won't text the dreamy. We'll take it.
and then you got your see they got all sorts of this is what this is what they they did better um i mean the bullet cam is cool and all but I, that, that'll that'll just get old like you know i don't know that'll get old to me quick to me but i love the fact that they that all these little tracks are the, the stuff that they tracked even the windage and stuff of what when you made the shot um uh, the meat salvaged and all that when it comes to a badger you're not gonna hunt it for meat but other animals uh it'll say like how much of the meat was salvaged and all that so it's kind of cool I, I, I love the fact that they managed to do all that what a great people to work with you must be talking to somebody else because you're not talking to me <laughs> although i do work with a bunch of great people uh, 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 uh. harvest use either the stand wait i just did that oh i gotta do another one okay because i'm calling i'm calling the herd all right, let's uh, let's just go up here. And look down on them instead of climbing up the stand. See how grainy it got as soon as I walked into the bush? Huh? Weird. Oh, I know what it is. It's actually the leaves because you can actually see through them. Ah, that's the first time I noticed that. That's actually kind of cool. So they make them. Semi-transparent. They turn grainy. But, ah, that's kind of cool. I like that. Can't go down. Look at that long shot. Boom. Boom. Take it. All right, to buy a new rifle, open the store and look uh, at the computer. All right, we'll walk back. We'll walk our way back. Badgers, Taco. What I say? Did I say something else? Did I call them something else? I may have called them something else. I get caught up into things. Don't judge me. Teabag it? No, I'm not going to teabag it. Gross. <laughs> I'll, I'll teabag the next animal, <laughs> which will be a deer. I think uh, the, the final animal with the tutorial is a deer. And then we jump into the story. What time is it? What the heck's my... Oh, my, uh oh. I think my watch is dead. My watch screen isn't turning on. Rut roll. Might be getting a new watch. Let's see what... Uh, 931. Okay. So where's everybody from? I know we got a few Michiganders in here. Where's everybody from? Taco, can you please use an obnoxiously large rifle to shoot? I, I you know, I will, uh, but uh, I have to buy one first. So, like, I'll do the 308. <laughs> the, so they got seven millimeter, and they have a 308. So 308, 308 will be the obnoxiously over obnoxiously large weapon. Um, oh, D Town! Whoop, whoop. Uh, do you? Uh, so Tiger, do you? Uh, have HBO Max because uh, the Lions are the hard knocks this year, preseason hard knocks, uh, and it's pretty good. Uh, you know, I mean, even though it's the Lions, right? Same old Lions. We deal, we deal with what we deal with with them, but uh, it's it's still good. It's hard knocks. You know, they they put it together well. Um. Yeah. Anyway, have you checked that out yet? UK, Texas, Alpina. Oh shit. LP, oh, so, so shop. What was I supposed to do? I was not. I didn't read the chat. Was I supposed to buy this weapon here? I think I was supposed to buy this. Bye. Um, owned. So I still haven't unlocked because there's uh one weapon here that gets unlocked that's free as well. This is Grandpa's old thing, or it's just it, no, it wasn't in Grandpa's. It's just part of the DLC that. When you bought the more expensive pack. All right, we're poor again. Ski! Mexico. So actual Mexico, not New Mexico, huh? Nice. Well, welcome. Welcome. I'm, I'm half Mexican. I don't know if you knew that. Half Mexican, 80% Swedish, 40% German, and 90% awesome. That's what I think what that's, I think that was the math I, I hit with old, with Fisk uh, yesterday. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm pretty sure. And let's not throw the scope on that as well. I also wish that you had to buy multiples of these scopes in order to have them attached. That's what one thing that uh, Called Wild doesn't do either. You can just have them attached on every, you know a same scope on everyone. If I can't quickly remove it, then there's no reason why I shouldn't have to buy it again. So I'd love to see him make you so you had to buy buy a repeat. I want out you know one of those things. I want it to be more difficult. U.S. Army brat currently living in Montana. Nice. Well, thank you for your service, Chris. Appreciate it. Or right, wait. U.S. Army brat. So your your parents, one of your parents is in the military then, right? Is what you're saying. So, well, thank you. Thank them. Which one of them or both of them for their service? Um, I shouldn't use this bad boy for more than 120 yards. 120 yards for that bad boy. 100 for the one and 120 for the other. I'll, I'll shoot farther than that because, hey, I'm taco. Welcome, Ben Ski, you sexy bastard, you. Ski is the other Olaf here, but he's the American Olaf. And he's only Olaf that he wants to be because he'll, he'll put the Viking gear on and then act like Olaf. And make ooh sounds. <laughs> All right, what are we supposed to do? Reach the upper grasslands area. Um, It's a long walk. Let's drive there. Let's just drive there. We'll drive close to it and then we'll walk. So we can get this uh, tutorial knocked out of the way. And 100% taco, right? Army brat means a parent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dad was a, a tanker, was Navy. I, I was Navy. Oh, so you, wait. You're both, your, your parents and you are, are, are military then. You are, you are an army brat. Okay, army brat, but you're, you were Navy. Okay, well, thank you either way for your service. It's still military, right? Same with Ski. Ski was military. Hundred percent. Thank you to Ski as well. I'm driving, so I'm paying attention because I'm a safe driver here. At least he's not a snowman, uh, like Olaf. Yeah, oh, that's not that Olaf. He's Olaf from a different game, or from a from a different thing. It just happened to share the name. Confused, poor Taco. Yeah, I'm. Hey, I'm trying to do multiple things at once here. <laughs> I'm trying to put two and two together while I'm I'm multiplying five times twenty, which isn't even that, that hard. I don't know why I said that. I remember when I couldn't tell the difference between a white-tailed deer and a mule deer. Everybody used to tease me about it. Oh, I remember that. Why? Why? No, I don't remember that yet. We will remember that. That's foreshadowing, there, people. Let's see if I Woo. Oh, man, I'm not even in the location yet. Oh, so I got to get up there before I can make the shot. Because if I shoot an animal now, it's not going to count for my tutorial. That stinks. So we're going to get pretty close to these dudes. We're going to do some creeping. The wind is... Oh, it, it's blowing that way. The deer to the right a little bit. Let's let's give them... Let's step off to the right a little bit for them. Actually, I think they cleared out. I may have spooked them. I probably did spook them. I did. All right. We'll stand up. Oh, oh, never mind. Did you see him stop? I'm not in the zone. Son of a bitch. This is, you know, this is Noosk's fault. We're blaming Noosk. Taco driving better at Fooster and Fisk. Hey, I, I, well, uh, yeah. Yeah. That's why they hate me so much because I'm so much better than them at everything. That's what they tell me. They just don't leave that. They always cut that. They edit that stuff out. The compliments. They edit the compliments out. <laughs> Aim for the head. That's not the way of the hunter, Justin. <laughs> or should I call you Fisk? Oh, I want to take it out. 
Oh, no! Alright. Oh, and they're coming this way! We're getting their way closer. I need to get around them before they come up into this gully. This little drainage ditch. Oh my gosh, Chad just blew up for a second there. They're gonna wind you. I know, I'm trying. I'm, I'm creeping around. I'm creeping around. I'm creeping around. Uh, stop screaming! <laughs> Don't yell at me! Get in the zone! <laughs> I'm trying! Oh, oh I spooked them. Alright. Alright, what we're gonna do, there's gonna be more. I guarantee there's gonna be more at the bend. So, here's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna walk. We're just gonna walk up to the stand. Get in the stand and wait them out. These guys are running that way. They may work their way back around. We'll see. <laughs> uh, scream at me, Taco. <laughs> wow, way to, way, way to go. I... Noosk, do me a favor. Change your name. Change your name on here so I know. Because uh, I will forget that you're Noosk. 100%. And I'll be like, hi, Alana, where are you from? <laughs> Change your name to Noosk on, uh, uh, on uh, Google, please. I don't know if I can. Maybe I can change your name so it appears as Noosk. I'll have to, I'll have to take a look. I, you know, that's one thing you can do on Twitch is edit somebody's name so it appears different for you. Uh, I think you actually have to do it through your Google account and how you appear as. You don't have to. I'm joking. You do what you want. It's your account. Oh, yeah. See, there's some deer up there. There's some deer up there. Yeah, let's get some range on them. We're, we're cheating here. So 160. We're in the 160 range. So we'll, we'll crank this up. Now, they said nothing below 120. You know why? I because the velocity drops. You know, the, the 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 wind resistance on the bullet kicks in and uh, the velocity will drop so the impact will be less. But we'll take the shot anyways because, you know, that's that's how we roll. We're not going to take that shot though cuz they're really far away. That one's bedding down, maybe. <clears throat> See, this looks grainy from up here. Oh, do I have I have hunter sense on? That's why. I'm like, this looks grainy. <laughs> I have hunter sense turned on still. I'll be turning that. Oh, like I said, I'll be disabling hunter sense once I can. Once it um, uh, opens the ability to do that. But I, in all honesty, I'm gonna watch this resetting. What's going on? I wonder if I got water in it. I went for a swim yesterday, but my watch is waterproof. But yeah, maybe some water got into it. I'm not gonna wait till it's gonna run, but I want to make sure I got a good broadside shot. I want, like, right there. That's a good one. Right. That was a little high. But I think we should have been lung. This is where you wait it out. And you just watch them. I don't know if he went down in there or if he kept going. But if you go chasing right away, this is where this game is balanced really well. Just kind of let them let him run it out a little bit. That way you don't keep spooking them like in real life. And uh, you, you you just you let it bleed out. <clears throat> uh, two forty three can shoot two hundred meters, no problem. Oh yeah, but uh, the game, the you're basing it off the game statistics, right? Two forty three can easily shoot two uh two hundred meters. Uh, it, well, that's two hundred meters, anyways. Um, I, I you know I don't go by meters. Let, let me let me let me show you something. This right here. This is the only measurement I use. It's called freedom units. Kaka. They're measured in kakas. How many kaka away is it? The ski even put it in there. Kaka. It's it's the cry of the eagle. 
It's the freedom unit. It's the only measurement we go by. How fast are you going? I'm going caca. <laughs> he goes by freedom units. Yes, 100%. Luca blew out the backstrap. Oh, here we go. I wasted some meat. I wasted some good quality meat, the backstraps. I wasted out the tenderloins. <laughs> I got a coffee and a sandwich. Ooh. What kind of sandwich did you make? Is there a good range for guns? It depends on the weapon. It depends on the weapon. I mean, I, most weapons, the closer the better, in all honesty. But, I mean, rifles, obviously, you don't want to be, you're not going to be face-to-face. -face. All right, we're going we're gonna to go, we're going to go do some tracking. I was sleeping because I'm lazy. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> I was going to wake you up, Onan, and say, hey, I'm going live, but I didn't bother. I, 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 uh, Bill here and uh, Olaf, so I wasn't too worried. And, and honestly, chat, our community is pretty freaking good. And I think I have it set to sub only, so I don't get those, uh, you know, uh, the bot spams, the, the porn ones and stuff. So, uh, so that's one trick if you're streaming on YouTube. Subbing is for free, so you just switch your chat to sub only, and that just that it keeps those bots from being able to spam crap. Freedom units: thirty donuts equals one meter. What's that supposed to mean? You calling us fat? You calling us fat? <laughs> A donut does sound good. A donut does sound good. Where did I shoot that at? It was next to this bush, wasn't it? Earth. All right, let's find this blood. I'm so if you're new to this game, and if you are gonna be using Hunter Sense, when you have a Hunter Sense enabled, when you walk, it does not work. This is where people say, "Oh, the blood disappeared," and they're they're walking around. Um, there is a perk I think that will unlock over time a character skill, uh, where um, you can walk and use your um your uh, hunter sense at the same time but you have to stop and look right for it to work so people think oh it's it's glitched but it's not it's just it's how the game works right it's 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 just you're not at that level yet so yeah I, you know i'm not gonna use hunter sense i'm gonna try to track this thing without i just gotta find the blood first like, i remember where i shot it it was somewhere around here i thought right it was next to this big bush So we, we got to we got to find the splatter. But then it ran around this way. So we want to see how we hit it. And it ran up through there. But I want to see how good the shot was. You know, let's get this tutorial knocked out. Screw it. Shut up, pheasant. Shut your mouth. You're not no freedom bird trying to be you caca wannabe. Oh, that's one hunting that I do. I used to love to do. I haven't hunted in forever, IRL. But I, oh, pheasant hunting was so much fun. Because you're walking around, right? You're legit walking around. Weapon at hand. Whether you're running a gun or running dogs or not, you know, and uh, you're kicking bushes. And, uh... And then shoot and move. That's where you do shoot moving targets. <laughs> it, it, it's not sportsmanlike to shoot a ground bird. So you want to, you, you, you kick it up, let it fly, give it a, give it a, give it a running chance and you take your shot. All right, let's find, let's find this blood trail. All right, so there's path. That's not, all right, we'll, we'll get into that after the tutorial. But the, the, the game is cool because their, their, um, need zones are balanced. It worked out properly. Where the hell did I hit this thing? Now, Fist did say there was a glitch where you do hit it, get a hit, and it doesn't register as a hit. And I know I hit it. Everybody saw I hit it. Z zip back to that time spot where I hit it. I'm telling you, I hit it. <laughs> now, we'll see if we can't find any blood up here.
See, there's a need zone here. Drinking. Drinking rarely. So they hardly drink there. They just, what, stand there and poop? What's going on? I think you missed. I didn't miss! I hit it! I, I, I know I hit it. I know I hit it. See? See, there's blood. It just looks like rust. All right, we're going to creep up. We're going to see if we can't spot him again. More pheasant. These deer are going to work their way back down anyways. Have a great stream. Darth, thank you for stopping in. I have a lot of yard work to do today. Oh, I feel you. I feel you. I hate yard work. I hate yard work. The more yard you have, the worse it is, right? But have a good day. I believe you. Thank you. Thank you, Olaf. Olaf always has faith in me. Mule deer. How far away is that? That's about right distance. See, I hit it. I know I hit it. Shut up, pheasant. Go, go fake freedom fly your way out of here. I flubbed that comment up, but it's okay. All right, we'll wait that out. I know I hit that. You saw the bullet trajectory just... Oh, yeah, so Taco uh, uh, Chat have apparently never heard that Taco beat a uh, uh, deleted game. Uh, you know, any game that you think I, that I haven't played, um, I, I most likely played it, and I beat it and delete it within minutes because that's how good I am. That's how good I am. Fortnite, beat it and delete it. So easy. So easy. Beat it and delete it. Tetris, beat it and delete it. Minesweeper, beat it, delete it. All right, I'm already irritated. The pheasant are turning into Call of the Wild ducks. Is it me? Is it me? Are you getting annoyed with how much they, they, they chirp? Shut up! Nobody likes you! All right, where was that standing at? I really should pay attention to where the animal's standing before I come walking. Tracking in this game is way more difficult. Which I like, because Call of the Wild, like uh, it'd be like standing up, it'd be popping, you know, in, in red or whatever color you set it at. This one, on the other hand, not so much. You gotta be like right near it. I know I heard it, but I'm not seeing any tracks at all. It was not in the trees. It was down here. Shut up, pheasant. Shut up, pheasant. Desiree, welcome in. It's going to be a short stream, Desiree. Uh, I got things I got to do today. But uh figured it would be a good, you know, kick, kick, kick this game off for me uh, with solo play. All right. All right, chat, I need your help. Am I missing something here? Besides the deer, don't say I missed the shot because you all saw I hit both of them. What was that? What was that? That sounded like beastly. Were you under attack? Okay. <clears throat> 
you're missing. Stop it. News. Oh, news changed your name. News changed your name. No longer Alana. Alan Alana sounds so pretentious anyways. What a pretentious name. <laughs> Anybody that's really named Alana, I apologize. I'm just making fun of my friend Noosk because she's super rich. Super duper rich. So there was the rock I shot over, right? And I I I think I might have a glitch where the, 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 the stuff isn't registering. Because I hit it. I hit it. Unless I was, I wasn't, it didn't say anything about having to hit it with a specific weapon. Right? Yeah, harvest a mule deer whitetail. No, it didn't, yeah. So it shouldn't have mattered. And even with the 30 30, it, it, it still, even with the lower velocity at that range, it should have penetrated. Man, what's happening here? All right, we're going to walk the way that they went and see if we can't spot any trail. Just like we did before. Oh, I saw something over here, I thought. All right, there's poop. Wait, there's blood. Oh, there we go. Found it. Small amount. All right. Small amount. What? Is this my hit right here? No. So this must have been farther up than I thought. Was it up in the trees? That seemed like it was down there when I took the shot. Unless it was running from over here. Either way, we're going to follow that. We're going to track that. I already lost. I already lost the track. <laughs> I already lost the trail. You know what? You know what? Even with uh, okay, my my plan was to. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Clear. So I think I hit high. I didn't hit lung. Even with um, hunter sense, this game is way way hard. And I was going to be like, go, I'm going super difficult and advanced with no hunter sense enabled. I, 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 I re, I'm revising my statement. <laughs> oh, we've been AFK. All right, uh, Olaf. Yeah, you do you, brother. Going to play a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do that. Turn me down if you have to because you, this game is based off a lot of audible, right? Appreciate you helping out, man. Have fun. All right, they ran off this way. There's more poo. Some more poo. All right, is that blood? I thought that was blood. Where's the blood? Where'd the blood go? Where'd the blood go? I lost the blood already. I feel like Fisk. Because the first time I played this, I literally shot it, it ran up the hill, and dropped. I watched it just run up the hill, lay down, and, and, and fall asleep peacefully. Because that's, you know, that's what happens. And then uh, this one, this one, of course, when I go live and I got an audience, I <laughs> the struggle kicks in. I mean, at least I look good against those badgers. Stupid weasels. The weaker weasel. Am I right? Am I right? Wolverines are the better weasel. I saw a badger the other day on the way to work. Sticking his head out along the side of the road. You don't see badgers too often. They're usually pretty. Well, they're, they, I think they're nocturnal. You know, I hate to do this. It's not really the, the thing to do is just 
shoot multiple deer and then hope you find one. But I want to get this stupid tutorial done. I want to be done with this tutorial. So we're at 120 right there. We're going to take out the doe. Forty and shot. Oh, no, that was a buck. I thought that was a doe. He's hopping along like he didn't even get touched. Is that me? With the legendary skills, you can show a thousand yard shot on a moving pheasant with 22. You're right? That's what you used to do in Call of the Wild with the take 22 and just, you know, the birds flying overhead, just start popping them off. Um, and just let them float to you over the lakes. Just just go to town just because 22 bulls were so cheap and you fire them off so quick. And the 22, it, it qualified for, for bird. It was based off a of caliber, not off of actual used weapon <laughs> which was always silly to me you're never gonna you're not gonna use a 22 when you're out duck hunting that's just that's just silly but it qualified because it was just based off of numbers so that was that, that always bugged me but i did it anyways because it was, it, it was viable <laughs> level out tacos going to find like uh 20 corpses late i know right And once again, I didn't really pinpoint where I shot that at. And I should have. Because now I'm going to be looking looking for that impact zone again. All right, that's all need zone up there. Oh no, that, there there's I think that's it right there. I think that's it right there. I uh, love the stream, Taco, but I've got to sleep now because it's 11.30 p.m. All right. Well, thank you for joining in. Thank you for joining in. Here we go. Small. <laughs> small amount of blood. Why does it say small? See, it ran up this way, and then it did a loop-de-loop. -loop. And it ran up this way. Because we saw it. There it is. It's bleeding regularly. Just a small amount. So I must uh, probably hit high. Well, I'm guessing I probably... Because I quartered, quartered the shot. I probably hit shoulder blade, to be honest. But a shell should have had enough to make it through and get... It gets in the lung, right? Am I right? 12 out of 10. Noosk, knock it off. <laughs> Noosk is like, oh, when I have when I have my servants take my shots for me, you know, they never miss. But then again, I have 10 of them shooting at once. And then they have their servants shooting for them as well. So there's no chance for the for the animal to survive. I'm news. What's that? What's this zone? Is this a bed bedding zone? Pheasants. Look. I'm irritated with the pheasants because they won't shut up. Alright. I shouldn't have looked at that because I lost the track. Where'd the track go? It's right up through here, right? Am I right? Am I right? Damn. That kind of scared me. I'm not going to lie. That spooked me. I jumped a little bit. All right. That is right here. Okay. Small amount of blood. Right there. All right. It's there. It's there. Up there. Ooh, wait, is that a that's a need zone? That must be a bedding zone. Shoot. Where'd it go? Wait, 
I had something. Analyze. What's this? You don't even see it. Oh, no. Is it healing? There it is. Uh, making the deer. I'm not making the deer suffer. I'm, 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 I'm making them stronger by adding some lead weight to them. Look at it this way. I'm adding, I'm adding some weight to make them stronger. So in the future, they're going to, they're going to, they're going to be beefier and they're going to be able to survive other hunters that aren't as good as me. So these are strategic shots. They're strategic shots. All right, let's check. This is, I'm guessing this is a bed zone here. Well, that's blood right there. So we know where that's at. Wait, I, there we go. Eating. All right, so there's the blood. We're going to do a little creeping because I think these deer are coming towards us right now. Uh, Michael Valentine, Taco, good, uh, good game. I've, uh, get to work now. All right. Have, have a safe day. Have a good time at work. I said good time at work, but yeah, thank you for joining. I don't know how, how many people have a good time at work. I enjoy my job. I don't know. Do you guys enjoy your job? What do you do for a living? If you don't mind me asking. Eagle! Ca -ca! My freedom bird has joined. Looking for blood trails isn't a good, isn't a good sign. Listen, Eagle, this is how freedom, this is how we do it in freedom, in Freedomville. You know this. You're, you're my, you're my, you're my spirit animal. Eagle's here. Those of you who don't know, Eagle Eagle is my cousin, my Swedish cousin. Fisk likes to say that he's his cousin, but it's not true. Just ask him. Ask Eagle. Eagle will agree. Fisk just makes things up. Fisk likes to tell tell stories. All right, I lost the blood. I lost the trail. Oh no. Oh no. It ran through this tree, I think. We are causing him to be reckless. Yeah, you know what? It... Desiree, I think you're right. We're, I'm going to blame chat. I'm blaming chat here. This is your fault, chat. Nice work. Way to way to ruin my game. <laughs> way to ruin it, chat. You're distracting me with your awesomeness. All right. If I see another deer, I'm shooting at it. I hope you all know this, right? Let's load up. Oh, there it is. Found the found the trail. Are they on the bridge? They're walking on the bridge. Do they not know that's a human bridge? That's not for them. That was put there so I don't get my pretty little feet wet. My my pedicured toes don't get all mucky in in that in in that creek. And yet they're using my bridge. They need to go down. I can't tell how far that is. It's 200 and something. Okay. I don't like the way they're looking at me either. Oh, that was high. <laughs> the second shot was high. I was shooting at the other one running. I was hoping to hit it. <laughs> I'm just going to unload.
Sorry, right, teach them get all, go on my bridge. Gonna miss again. Noosk. Noosk. Mm, you know, my weapons are oh, high end weapons, high tech. I use my, my $700 Leopold scope. Actually, this is a Leopold scope as well. You can see, tell by the L in the crosshair. For those of you who don't know, I, that's what I have on my uh, thirty. My IRL thirty at six is a a large, large Leopold scope thing. is huge. Looking like a good shot for the first one. It 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 did, but they all looked like good shots. I'm not gonna lie. We're gonna keep tracking this, and then. We'll, you know, out of the four deer that I shot, we're bound to come across one of them. <laughs> uh, the devs are going to watch this, maybe, <laughs> and shake their head. And if they do watch this, devs, fix the multiplayer, please. Give us tasks, give us challenges, and fix the brokenness of multiplayer. Because it just it, it's a needed thing, one hundred percent. Out of all things, that's what's needed. Solo is fantastic. This game is beautiful. Runs great, especially for a new game. As solo, a lot to it. But yeah, multiplayer. I I give it a a two out of ten. I give it a noosk scoring for multiplayer. And, you know, when uh, Fisk Booster and I play a, a lot of Call of the Wild, you know, that, that's where we kind of base it off of, right? What caliber are you running? You know, I don't even know which one I have in my hand right now. I ain't... Okay, so it's this one right here. So it's the 30-30 is the lever action, I think. I forget which one's which. One of them's 243, one of them's 3030. Oh, the 3030 is a lever action. I'm almost positive. So I'm, I'm, I have the, third, yeah. So I actually, I probably should have switched up on that. So 243. I think I shot the first one with the 243, and the rest have been the 3030. Taco and his paintball rifle, right? Oh, like I said, what I'm doing is I'm just stockpiling. We're, uh, or, or actually, Ski said it. I'm going to come across all my animals, and then I'm just going to rake in the dough. Rake in the dough. Now, the first one didn't leave any blood, or I couldn't find any any trail. Um, after that, I just, I thought they were good shots. They should have been good shots. I mean, they're right there in the bread basket. But they register as not good shots. So I lost the trail. Let's take a look. Let's see if we can, oh, wait. Here it is. Found the trail. But then that other deer I hit, which, in all honesty, I may have hit the same deer multiple times. Weren't they standing? Yeah. Yeah. Look. Look. Them deer were using my bridge. My Protect Tacos Pedicure Bridge. That's what they call this. They named this this. The devs actually, they, they just forgot to put the sign in. It says, Protect Princess Taco's Pedicure Bridge. Oh, the water's so loud. Pink. Medium. Oh, here we go. Medium amount air bubbles. That's good. That's good. All right. All right. So that was a long shot. That was definitely a long shot. All right. We're going to keep creeping.
Let's uh turn this. Uh yeah, let's keep it a hundred. We're loaded. We are. Uh, Desiree, you taking off? Uh, anyway, gotta go. All right, Desiree, thank you for stepping in. Have a good one. Finds one deer with 20 bullets holes in <laughs> right? That's what I think it's going to be like. If it has more than one shot, then I know I've definitely, you know, that, that was part of the plan, we're going to say. No, this one will definitely, we'll find this one for sure. As long as we can stay on the trail. So it turned up this way. Then we lost the trail. That's where we lose the trail. And then we lose the deer. Oh, here we go. Here we go. All grazes. They're not going to be grazes. They're all going to be insane shots, heart shots. But I just happen to come across the bionic buck every time. I uh, So what you don't know is I asked the devs for a special key um, for uber difficult. And that's what it gave me. You know, so that I'm playing... I'm playing a version of the game that nobody else has and it's called uh taco skills it just, it just it makes things way more difficult i mean you guys wouldn't even battle the, the sway is just out of control what you don't realize is this thing is swaying like for you it'd be like this the wind but for me because i'm compensating with my mouth so fast you don't realize it <laughs> Ethical hunting, zero of ten. Oh gosh, those were the days when I used to bring up ethical hunting to Fooster. Explain, teach him ethical hunting. It is though. Yeah, you, you want your, your, you know, as close a shot that's ethically possible with the weapon that you're using. Um, long shot, no head shots. <laughs> The headshot, the brain, in all honesty, is pretty small. Plus, you're damaging the skull. And you could just you could hit the jaw, and then you'd just be punishing the animal for quite a while. So the bread basket, the lungs, heart, kidney. And it's going to run for a while, but... I thought I saw another... Oh, there it is up there. Okay. I wish I had one quarter of taco skills. Thank you, Bill. See, B Bill gets me. Bill understands. Bill trusts what I say. Noosk. Noosk, on the other hand, I wish I had one quarter of Noosk money. That's what I wish I had. All right. Did it cross the river? I'm seeing like a need zone up there, but I'm assuming it crossed the river because it came from that way. Uh, uh oh. I wish I had four of, well, you know, that's not possible. You know, on, only I can have that skill level, Eagle. Just hit one with the Jeep. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I did that when I first played too. First, the first time I got on, ran into one with the Jeep. It's funny that they let you do that and it does damage. Takes them out. That's kind of it's kind of cool little effect that they threw in there. Have you seen the great outdoors with uh, John Candy? Yes, yes. That's the one with the bear. Is that? Wait, yeah, that's the one with the bear, right? The bear. They shoot the bear in the butt at the end. 
Great movie. Great movie. That's late 90s as well. What's funny is you're following three different blood trails, not one. I I know, they're all running together. It's all they're all bled together. No pun intended. And I lost I lost all three of them. Four of them. Well, the three of them technically, because the first one I couldn't find. It ran to the river and lost me in the river. It start you you could hear him singing, wait in the water. Wait in the water, children. <laughs> yeah, they, 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 they escaped my clutches. All right, let's go back to this one and see where if we can walk up. See, we don't have a hunter mate, and you know there is no like. Like directional it went that way but you can only base it off of so this last one right so let's do a straight line and see if this helps us but at any point it could be like I want to go this way no I want to go that way wait what's that up there though real quick let's check a look at this real quick so that's a fox drinking zone Probably drifted in the water. All right, so we're going to, and then, so it's like, whoop. We're going towards that rock, okay? It's a middly rock. No, it is, it's hiding it in its salt. Anybody that knows where that reference is from. Tracking trail skills, three up. Why are you so mean, noose? What do you mean to me? What'd I do? What'd I ever do to you? White-tailed deer. Woo! That's one thing we haven't seen or shot at yet, or is a deer. <laughs> oh, look! Look what I found! <laughs> I found it! It was right here the whole time, just blending in. Alright, let's take a look at this. Oh, it's so loud next to that. Oh, this one I did hit twice. Let's go. First shot. First shot was, uh, okay, a little high. A little high. Oh, uh, hunting rating. See, I got four out of five stars. So technically, that's an eight out of ten, Noosk. Eat that. Eat your three out of ten, two out of ten, one out of ten, BS. That's an eight out of ten. Hunting rating. So, uh, let's see here. Okay, second one. Boom. Lungs. Okay. That's a better shot for sure. And then it lodged. Oh, nope. Still going. It's still going. Still going. Double penetration. Oh, it's still going. Complete penetration. Finish him. That's what it screamed. So that was with 30-30. They both were 3030s. Okay, so yeah, I went a little bit light light load on those. Yeah, we'll sell those. We need the money. Woo! We unlocked multiplayer. Not gonna use it. Not gonna use it. Devs, fix it. So that means there are two other animals that are possibly dead, definitely wounded out there. <laughs> or maybe one one possibly two because I, I took four shots right Taco are you apex yes that's a silly question did you see did you see how well that bullet placement was how easily I found it how how, how short amount of time I had to track that animal if that doesn't scream apex nothing will Right? You saving for a new gun? Uh, well, I, I just I want to play through the tutorial, uh, which I just finished up. Um, and yes, always, right? That's the name of the game. You know, you always 
because there's bigger and better animals. Um, and you need, and even smaller ones, you know, you need, you need the other, you need other, you need the other weapons. So like the seven mil would be a good one to get. I want the 308, but I, I don't even know what animals are out there for the 308. Probably, I don't even know what animals there are. I haven't really seen many. I, I'm still, I haven't like dove in deep with this game. Um, so I don't even know all the animals that are on here. Uh, I have a free shotgun that I can go claim now. So we'll just fast travel, fast travel back up here. And, uh, you know, we'll start up the story. We'll, we'll start that story. And then uh, maybe we'll take out another animal. What time? Oh, God, my, phone, my watch is doing something derpy. 10.30. So I have a half hour and then I got to dip. Seven mil feet. All of the fucking kind of badgers infested. <laughs> well, not, like I said, 308 is bigger than the seven mil. Right? Yeah, 308 is bigger than the seven mil. Let me in! Grandma's down there. Bear, moose, elk. No pheasant, noose. Uh, yeah, we'll do fe Well, actually, the first mission you have to do is a pheasant. Hello, Wallace. Hope this email finds you well. <laughs> I hope this email finds you. Who opens an email like that? Has anybody ever sent an email with the, with the preface of, I hope this email finds you well? <laughs> so formal. How are you? How is everything? I think that's, you know, the how are you is kind of covers the how is everything, you redundant bastard. Uh, it's, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I'm critiquing this email like it's real life. <laughs> it's that time of year when Chang wants to introduce some kind of crazy twist to his menu. You know him last year, it was Beijing duck. This year, it's chicken recipe. It's our chicken recipe. Uh, the midwife, cri mid midwife. The midwife crisis. <laughs> the midwife crisis of 2022. <laughs> Given birth has been never, never been more difficult. Uh, the midwife crisis can take more, many forms. I guess uh, this is my husband. Uh, uh, I'll be upgrading our uh, general Chow's chicken, but is some pheasant meat. Uh, you are very welcome to visit us again as your favorite. Sushan hotspot. Uh, I hope or I am still holding on to your bottle of uh, whatever that is. It's waiting for you here. Blah, 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 blah. All right. Accept. Boom. Don't judge my reading and my grammar skills. Haha, <laughs> I remember that too. Shut up. All right. So this is the 3030. We're going to get rid of the 3030. Um, uh, clear. We're gonna throw the shotgun in. So shop. We got a freebie shotgun. Claim. Owned. Okay. Storage. Equip. All right. So now we got the shotgun. Boom. How much money do we have now? Sixteen hundred. So we can buy another weapon too. But we're gonna save up. Uh. Yeah, so it's a it's a three oh yeah. So here's the three oh eight. The three hundred wouldn't be bad to be honest. Actually, the three hundred is I think a better balanced weapon than even the than the seven millimeter or the three oh eight. Wait, the three oh eight's only a five? I thought the three oh eight is a bigger weapon. I don't know. I don't know. I don't fucking know weapons. Don't judge me. Oh, the 338. That's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, the 338. <clears throat> I was, I was, I was, uh, I was confusing the 308, the 338. So that's what it was. But uh, ba -ba -ba. is there a seven mil? There's a couple 22s. 22 long rifle. Um, another 22 long rifle. Oh, there's the seven mil. Okay, and that's a five as well. So three oh eight and the seven mil are the same hunting tier, hunter tier. So uh and then the three hundred is the beast. Okay. Damn. It's pretty cheap too. So maybe we'll save up and buy the seven, the the ba 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 ba, three hundred. SM12. The stayer. 
All right. What else? Oh, so we need to harvest pheasant. And then I think it goes into like you get a letter, and then that's when I stop because you play. It plays a little animated thing. Three thirty eight. Yeah. Right. Gasm. Freaking beast mode. That thing is insane. Have you ever shot? Like, what's the biggest weapon? If you shot guns IRL, what's the biggest weapon you ever shot? With the biggest kick. Because, um, like me, I, I haven't really gone, like, heavy monster guns. I've never shot a 50 cal or anything like that. But my 30 6 has a pretty decent kick. If I, if you have, so it has a, a break that you can open up on the muzzle. And if you have the muzzle break closed, it kicks like a Bitch. Oh, it hurts. But if you keep that muscle break open, it de it definitely, it probably reduces it by like 20%, 30%, the recoil. It feels so good. Harvest 6.61 pounds. I want to say when I played this last, it was only like 3 pounds that I had to harvest. This is a pheasant zone up here, so we're going to head down here and knock out these pheasants. Uh, 50 cal, 16 gauge slug. Yeah, that's, oof. yeah, single shot break. So break action, I take it. Uh, 338 uh, eight, from the 1800s. What? Oh, I've shot an old black powdered 20 millimeter. Yeah. See, we have a black powdered musket, but it is... Either before I was born or I was, you know, as a baby, it blew up on my dad. <laughs> my dad had gotten it out and packed it, and he packed it with some old powder and stuff, and he said it had some chunks in it, like it got got moisture in it. Uh, and he probably packed it too tight, or his, but yeah, it ended up uh, exploding on him. So now it's pieced together with with s s masking tape, or no, scotch tape in the gun cabinet. It was an old beast, too. It exploded in his face. It splinters in his cheek and stuff. Luckily, he didn't get more, take more damage than that. That's one thing with weapons, firearms. It's, it's tough. It's dangerous, right? All right. How ethical are we being here, chat? Tell me this. Are we going to take some shots at some ground? Ground birds? Are we gonna we're gonna give them a fair fair shot and spook them up and, and, and pop them up, pop them off? Because ethically, you spook them, you give them a fair running chance or flying chance, and then you take the shot, right? But like, there's one right there. I could easily knock it out. I could just boop. There's another one there because then that one will fly off and I could boop. But that one's a rooster. That one looks like a hen. Can't tell what those two. That one looks like a rooster, possibly. Yeah, that one's a rooster there, I think. That one's definitely a hen. Yeah, let's 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 let's, let's, let's take a let's take a flight shot right here. Fly, fly. Oh, I missed. Did I miss? Yeah, I missed. I shot over it. What? I was trying to lead it. All right, let's spook it up again. Just it didn't go very far. I was trying to lead it. That doesn't make sense because normally uh, you'd lead. You'd lead just by a little bit. Boop. All right, here it is, right here. So this time we're gonna aim at it. We're gonna pop. Yeah. So wow, that one was flying away from me. That one didn't really count. It was flying away from me. So that one you wouldn't lead anyways. Look at that. Mostly wing. Mostly wing. So this is where it's cool. Because it tells you how much... Um, well, this is the gene pool, I think, I think right? Vital organs. 8.25 pounds. The hunt. Loss by shot. 0.11 pounds. Not much at all. That was a good shot, right? You do a big broadside shot and hit it in through here, it's gonna, you're going to lose more meat. 
Busy day. All good. Mullet, appreciate you helping out whenever you can. All right, sell. All right, so they're all over there now. Wait, it's not like they're reminding you to. We'll go this way, though. Each animal has a fitness value, which affects the animal's trophy and size of the animal play. Close attention to it because you can change the average fitness of habitat by hunting low trophy score males and vice versa. Yeah, that, see, that's where this game is so cool, where they balance things out like that, where they, uh, um, where you can, you can call the crap out of the animals. And then, so, like, the higher-end animals will breed and make high-end animals. Shooting skills. Noosk. Why are you so mean to me? I was doing legit hunting. You, like, okay, let's say this bird, let's let... Shut up! That branch right there, right? It's the bird. And let's say it's flying left to right. IRL. I would pop my shot right there. I would I would leave if it was flying. It landed there, but then another one took off. I don't know if it's the same one or not. Autocrack made uh made me say a bad word. <laughs> it's alright. As long as you're not being rude or lewd or uh, like, you know, racist, obviously. You know, you can, you can, you can, as far as I'm concerned, you could swear. And you're an adult. No children swearing in my chat. All right. Oh! Ah, that should have been. See? I'm leading the thing. That's too far. Biggest for me is 50 B. 50 BM. The biggest for me is 50 BM. That's freaking huge. That's a huge weapon. Yeah, I've never shot. I've never shot a, you know, 50 cal. To be honest, you know, I, I'm, my favorite weapons to fire are like 22s. Air rifles. Because they're quiet. I hate loud noises. They're fun to shoot. You know, our air rifles, like, uh, my kids and I have, uh, air rifles that we shoot. And they're fun. They're a lot of fun. Here we go. Damn it! I'm, 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 oh god. I just gotta put the bead on it. Swear. <laughs> Is that your swear word? Swear. It's not what I meant. Anything 5.56 is fun. Not much uh, kick. Yeah, 22s. Like I said, 22s are fun. They're cheap rounds. Uh, you can shoot them at range. Uh, and they're relatively quiet. Right? I mean, a 22 pistol is a lot louder than a 22 rifle. Just, I mean, mainly just because the muzzle's closer to your face. But, um, yeah, a lot of it, I mean, it comes down to cheap rounds, too, right? All right, we're just going to finish this mission. Boom. The sound of this game is awesome. I'm outside, keeps looking at the pheasant. Yeah. The pheasant, like I said, are the ducks in Call of the Wild. There's just so many of them. And they're always, always chirping. I don't hear peasants that often. Oh, this was a female. <laughs> oh, I don't think I... Yeah, I didn't get the mission yet. All right. So we need one more. Uno mas. All right, a lot of the pheasants were off this way, so we're going to walk this way. I haven't fired a gun since 93. Taki, you have no idea how fun duck hunting is in this game. Oh, yeah? I'll check it out. I'll have to check it out. Uh, once I once I get the collar unlocked and stuff, I'll, I'll definitely take a look. Do you, uh, so that's Transylvania, right? That you duck hunt? We'll, we'll, we'll progress. I won't play this game unless I'm streaming. That's my plan. Um... Or I won't do missions, at least, unless I'm streaming. 
Maybe I'll, I'll earn some money off off to the side. Just so we can continue on with something, maybe. Looks like a cool game. It, you know, this game feels like Call of the Wild. What Call, of the, uh, Call of the Wild originally did for me. I played the shit out of that. You know, I'd, I'd after work, jump on and play for a couple hours to chill out before I went to bed. And then um, uh, Fooster had bought it, Call of the Wild, um, but refunded it. And that was when it first dropped because he was going to do a series on it. But uh, and, and the funny thing is the game still has that glitch, especially a new maps drop where an animal will be walking upside down in, in the trees. Um, and it took him out of took it took him out of it took him right out of it and he's like nope and he refunded it. Well then and then a couple months passed and I I started playing it and I I, I had uh, barked at him saying just get it try it I'm telling you it's so much fun and uh, and then then that's when the series had kicked off for us you know we we played it and uh, you know and then it, it blew up you know his, his uh, channel liked it. They didn't like me so much. <laughs> yeah, it was typical because that's when he started playing with me regularly. And uh, people would be like, I like it. Where's Forrest? Why are you playing with Tagwale when you play solo? You know you know how chat is. When they're used to one thing, they don't like change. Um, same thing happened with Fisk. Where's Taco? Who's this, this guy? And now people are like, who's Taco? <laughs> it's so much fun. I love watching chat and just the, the evolution of chat. Um, it's so much fun. Where's the Miss series? So it's, uh, uh, but it, yeah, it took off, right? And he loved it. You know, and it, it worked well. And then we played it out. We played the shit out of it and played, played ourselves out of it to the point, you know, and, and, but this game has that feel for me again, where I, 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 I haven't explored any of these maps. I love the layout. I love the complexity of it. Um, I mean, I, I have hours in this game, and I've only visited this. Well, counting, all right, counting time with Fisk and Fooster yesterday. We, I mean, this part of the map's been explored, and then Transylvania. It's like if we're the same spot, it's been like this area. So, Call of the Wild series is awesome. Yeah, well, they, they changed the scoring in that, and right when we we created the 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 challenge. The rat challenge is what it was called, right? Which people didn't realize the rat challenge was based off of a scoring system that the call, that the call of the wild originally had, but then they changed it so we couldn't do the rat challenge anymore. So people were like, "Where's the rat challenge?" What? Well, it wasn't possible with the new scoring system, and we weren't gonna work on building a new scoring system. Tango down. Not ethical, but oh well. We're finishing up this mission. So we can do, we can get jump into the next part of the story, and then we'll we'll we'll, we'll call it there. Uh, look at that brain shot. We'll, we'll, these are the Fisk shots right here. Uh, hunt, loss by shot, 0 0.05. That's a pretty damn good. That's you know very very little loss of meat. But with birds, you kind of want that. Like turkey, you shoot them in the neck or the you know head. That that's one thing you do do with turkey, right? You do do. I said do do. I know. You don't you don't do chest shots with turkey. Um, you you, you go for that head shot. So you do that fisk shot with turkey and stuff. But oh, with turkey, you also wait for the till they get pretty damn close, and then you take they take the slug to the head. <clears throat> that is the way of the hunter, right? <laughs> uh, all right, mission complete. All right, so pick up mail from the mailbox. All right, so we're gonna hear from Grandpa, and that's it. And then we'll, we'll we'll call. It. We'll watch a little animated thing that he does. Uh, let's uh, yeah, we'll walk up there. We'll walk up there. I'll catch up on chat a little bit. And I say catch up on chat, but uh, like like uh, Onan pointed out the other night, when I say oh, I'm gonna catch up on chat, I read one one message and then I get sidetracked, and then uh, and then ten minutes later, it's like oh, let me catch up on chat. <laughs> Because <laughs> I'm horrible. I'm horrible. I get so easily distracted. I'm oh so oh so, oh, so bad with uh, the the oh shiny thing syndrome. Uh, oh, you're all awesome. Uh, you guys make me uh, watch or 
make watching gameplay enjoyable. Thank you. I appreciate that, Nate. Yeah, you know, it's um, it's it's amazing. I was lucky to uh, be able to be part, you know, to meet up with Booster initially uh, as he was starting his Twitch, uh, and uh, you know, and the relationship grew from there. You know, friendship and a you know online brotherhood grew from there, and then I came across. Fisk through Call of the Wild, just looking for Call of the Wild streams at work, and uh, same thing. You know, I was helping him out, teaching him how to play the game properly, and I say properly, and I, I meant to, <laughs> I mean properly, without trying to be like, oh, do this, do that. But he was taking, he was taking uh, advice well, and uh, and then you know I met up with him, and uh, and you know now look, you know we we formed a group, the good guys. If you if you're new here, if you just happen to discover this this uh, channel or the stream. Or the, the video later, uh, the good guys. We have a community group. Uh, the good guys, uh, for, uh, disc, Discord forward slash, wait a Fiscord.gg forward slash the good guys. Or if uh, I can get one of the mods to post the link. Or, but the description is in below too. The link is in the description below. Um, and you can follow all of us, um, Booster and Fisk. Fisk just recently switched from Twitch uh, and went full time YouTube. And uh, he's soon to be quitting his job at the steel mill um, to go full time YouTube, which I'm very happy for him because he's ready. He's ready to be done with the steel mill. He's loving YouTube. Streaming is difficult, 100%. Streaming, especially streaming on Twitch, full time streamer, is becomes jo a job, right? My 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 view on streaming it, it should be fun, and when it's not fun, then why do it, right? It's going to translate. Your irritability is going to translate through to chat. And who wants that? Uh, and my OCD keeps me from being able to be a good editor <laughs> for my my uh, my videos, if I were to do videos, plus the fact that I can't talk to myself very well uh, and, you know, keep entertainment rolling. So I, I think uh, this, is, this, is, this is how I'm going to do things. I'm just going to stream. Hopefully on thir every night Thursday night, and then uh, you know one one more time randomly through the weekend, and post those as my videos. So that, that's my plan there. But yeah, follow the follow us on Discord. You can comment in there, send us direct messages in there. We have message areas in there: message Chaco, message Future, message this, message message you know, Chief, message Rock, all that. Message Proto. Uh, and, you know, any games you want to suggest? I mean, post them in the comments below too. Obviously, that helps algorithm for the videos. Uh, but uh, you know, a direct, quicker access there. So if the later, if the video begins older, you know, yeah, post post any questions in, in the message, Chaco, please, and I'll get back with you. See, look, I already got sidetracked. I got completely sidetracked from catching up with chat. <laughs> catch up on chat? I'll put catch up on you, ski ski. So what are your thoughts on catch up, chat? Ketchup, mustard. What are your condiment? What's your condiment of choice on burgers, dogs, brats? What's your, what's your condiment of choice? That's my question for you today, along with other questions that I threw at you earlier. But tell me, condiment of choice. Like my children love mustard. We can't, you know, mustard. We got to keep it stocked in the house because we we fly through it. They, they annihilate mustard. Um, I like most things, you know, ketchup, mustard, mayo. I'm a big mayo person, but I gotta keep keep it light mayo because uh, I try to stay healthy. I age. I, I can't. I can't eat too unhealthy. Oops. Jump. Ketchup on chat. Zero out of ten. <laughs> you and your you and your your rating system, Noose. All right. Let, let's check. Let's check this. Dear River. I've already told you a million times. I'll say it a trillion. Thank you so much for helping No, me technically this is a million and one. Once always place your orders with me by email. I think you wrote down my email password when you visited me in hospital. I don't trust the postal service enough to write it down here. In the hospital. I couldn't be happy. The hospital. You started in hospital. Again, what are you? Your father's from the UK? You're an adult now. You can make your own decisions. When he found out you were hunting with me as a kid without permission, and forbid you to ever visit me again. It broke my heart forever. So in a medical sense, 
This will help to heal the physical scars that share my heart tissue with the metaphorical ones. Do you remember Hollywood? Does I do! Name when we saw him no older than a few weeks? I do! I remember Hollywood! No, I'll do that. No, I don't remember Hollywood. I don't remember Caesar. Well, that muley is an old gentleman now. And unfortunately, he has abnormal antlers just like his father. It's a genetic trait that would spread further. I have one request. Taxidermy him for this nostalgic old man and put him right next to his family <coughs> in the lodge. He is the only trophy I left there. The rest, I had my friend Bustin Dustin move to a Bustin Dustin! Do you believe there's such a thing as too many trophies? I'll pay for this taxidermy, but for any others, you will have to save your own money. P.S. I wanted to shoot him many times, but every time my finger froze on the trigger because I think of him as yours. Thanks. P.S. Two. I have so little. Just put P.S.S. Hospital, I decided to draw a little present. Then I can go. Piss. Summers you spent in Nes Perce Valley as a kid. Uh, before we jump into the, the the next page here, let's see. Let's see what people say. Level really uh, full of sauce top. Uh, I really want to, uh, full, uh, I'm, I, don't, I, I don't know how to read that. Ketchup and mustard. Okay. <laughs> uh, despise ketchup. You despise ketchup. Really? Of those two mustard, stop eating ketchup all, all for a lot of uh, years, uh, da, 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 until I found one of the, with less sugar. Oh, okay. So you're not a big sugar person. That's good though. Healthy. Yeah. Ketchup has a shit ton of sugar, isn't it? Doesn't it? Uh, hello from across the lake, Taco. Oh, what you? Wisconsin, Illinois. What lake? Are you in Canada? <laughs> or are you in the UP? What lake? Uh, cause uh, you know, Michigan touches a lot of lakes. Um, now they're big on a burger condiments anymore. You know what? To be honest, the way. When I do make burgers, I'm usually grilling them. I'm smoking them. So like, a lot of times I don't put condiments on them either. I'll put like a pickle, pickles and stuff like that, but I won't put uh, uh, the, the the squeezable condiments uh, because it, the, the, they impart so much flavor. Well, I'll put, I, I also season them. I'll, I'll season them beforehand, dry season them. So that, that adds a lot of flavor too. What is going on, Ketchup Boy? Uh, how are you still here, Taco? You said short stream... Well, short. When I said short, short stream, I meant till eleven my time. So it is. It is. Yeah, it's technically short stream, sort of. Kind of. Okay, maybe. Uh, irritation of fear of catch. What? What? Irrational. I said irritational, but irrational fear of ketchup makes no sense. You do. Are you? Serious? Is that a real thing? What is it? What is that fear called? What it, is it? A irrational fear of ketchup. That's. What about tomatoes? Are, are you are you are you fear feared of tomatoes? Wisconsin. Okay, okay. Well, I was just bagging on the Badgers, so so I'm sorry, Zach, but welcome in, welcome in. But uh, Wolverines are are the better weasel. I I say that, and I hold hold steady to that because go blue. And I know like uh, Wisconsin, their their big rival is Michigan. Uh. And Minnesota, but uh, uh, but Michigan's big rival is Michigan State. Ohio State, obviously, is the biggest one. Notre Dame, and then Wisconsin falls in there, kind of a little bit, a little bit later down. But uh, Michigan is the, the rival of a lot of people, though, just because it's been around for so many years. It was highly televised. Uh, it's very real. I don't know what it's called. My older brother used to leave ketchup on the plate. Oh my, <laughs> that that is that is so weird. I mean, I say weird, but I mean, everybody has a fear of something, right? I hate spiders. I cannot stand spiders. Um, and, you know, some people, you know, think that's weird. But, I mean, it's more common, though, right? Now, let's jump ahead. Let's jump I ahead here. I decided to draw some situations we never talked about. And perhaps it'll be easier this way. Maybe you completely forgot about some. Maybe some still linger in you the same way they do in me. Expect more. No, that's just gas Your lingering. Your loving grandpa. Woo! Ooh, woo! Look at 
Grandpa's name is Uwu. <laughs> uh, so apparently, Grandpa drew this when he was in the hospital. And wait, wait let's 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 let's. It was summer 2000. Grandpa is an artist. The ten-year-old River was about to spend his first holiday with his grandparents. River could feel the adventure and mischief in his young. Grandpa is such an artist. Here, I'm going to turn the volume down just a little bit. It's blowing my eardrums out. Grandparents before. Wow, Dad, Dad. Sound mixer. Ask his father. What? Said Dad. I hope you can hear that. I adjusted that on the mixer, the audio mixer for Windows. I'll turn it back up after it. Dad is an a-hole. I gotta say, Dad is a big old a-hole. But not everyone shared their relation. Grandpa! Pappy! Grandpa has a badass beard. That's an Olaf beard right there. Look at that. Dick? To speak to you in private. I'd call him Dick. Look, he doesn't even shake his hand. Richard was amazed when he entered the lodge. The walls seemed bigger somehow, and the animals looked alive. Wait here. I've got something for you. But that's I've got something for you. Grandma's British. Even think about. I wonder if Fooster knows Grandma. I've got something for you. <laughs> a cup of tea. This is a hunting lodge after all. <laughs> Will you help me finish it? Will you help me finish it? <laughs> that is that is definitely Booster's grandma. He already felt it was his best summer yet, but it was about to get even better. <laughs> That's how he met Look at these kids, they have giant heads. That is not safe. You didn't ever roam around the woods with fake antlers on. You could get shot for realsies. Kids are not safe. This is what hunters do, isn't it? No. Real hunters are ethical. Ethical. Keyword, ethical. Yeah. Unlike that person shooting earlier and let those bucks just roam around. He was also determined to find out more about his mother as his father and grandfather never spoke of her. I didn't know my mother hunted too. Oh, you found the album. Oh, you found the album. You found the picture book. <laughs> that's my that's my impression of Booster's grandma. You found the picture book. But this secret was for another day. Time flew by, and soon the summer was at an end. I'm telling you, I I wish I had a grandpa that was this good of an artist. Animated at that. Where's the beef? Echo is a hill. How can a hill be a friend? Ah. Nice. All right. Well, I think, you know. We're going to end the gameplay there. We'll do a little bit of closing. Let me jump my closing scene and uh, chat a little bit. I'll catch up with chat. <laughs> I'll catch up with chat by reading one. <laughs> and then get sidetracked by asking what your favorite condiment is. <laughs> I'm the worst. I'm telling you, I'm the worst. I'm so easily distracted. Yeah, like I said, anyway, if I do anything, I'm not going to do any more storyline. I'm not going to do any mission. Because, I mean, look at the, 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 the storyline right there. Like, they add animation. They add, you know, there's 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 con context to it. It just feels good. So I'll do that live, um, and uh, post that as my videos. But then, if anything, I'll probably do a little more gameplay, just shooting stuff. But I won't really venture too far out of the zones that I've already uncovered. Uh, just to earn some money. So if I want to buy some weapons later, I'll, I'll have I'll have those available. If that makes sense. So that that that's gonna be my plan. Um. Uh, let it, let us switch to, do, do, do. I need, I need to hotkey these things so bad. Um, let's go to the farm and exit out of here, exit game. Um, 
Yes. And then we'll put some fixed fisk beats on. Once again, fisk beats. Uh, be sure to check it out uh, uh, on your favorite thing down below. Uh, actually, I, I will add after after the stream here uh, in the description a link to fisk beats. Uh, that way, if, if you're interested, you can check out uh, Fisk and his amazing music that he posts, and he's generating more. Like I said, every every couple months, he seems to be pop, dropping dropping some new beats. And and you know, he sits there. I'm like, hey, Fisk, what's going on? He's like, oh, I'm just playing the piano, making some new beats. Thank you, Mullet. Thank you, Mullet. Yeah, right there. If you, if you if you happen to be watching right now, um, click that link. But uh, like I said, otherwise, I'll throw it in the description below. Well, let me let me catch up on chat a little bit. I missed a lot. I missed I missed a lot. When I'm playing a game, I'm I'm gonna miss a lot. So spiders? Question mark? Taco should never come from Montana. Well, spiders large enough to be you know to cover the bottom. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, we have some big spiders here. Like the wolf spiders can get quite large. Um, yeah. Actually, I should. I, I mean, I live in an old house. My house was built in 1900. Um, so naturally, there's cracks and stuff. So. We bug bombed it when we bought it <laughs> back in 2003. Um, but I uh, haven't bug bombed it since. Uh, um, but uh, so I, I, we really should, when we go away for a weekend, is uh, put some bug, bug bombs, set, set them off <clears throat> to kill off some of, some of these spiders in here. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh <coughs> Gosh dang. Something in my throat. I wish I could grow a beard naturally. Laugh what? What? It'll go good with the mullet, mama. It would be glorious. Could you imagine? The bearded lady. Mama mullet with the beard. <laughs> Michigan has wolf spiders. Yes, yeah, they do. Yeah, they're huge. They're gross. Hairy. Disgusting. And scary. Good morning, Mr. Sauce from South Carolina, and uh, happy time zone to all. Happy time zone, Scott. Or that could be like SoCal. <clears throat> I'm assuming it's South Carolina. Right? You know, I don't even know all the abbreviations for the states. Some of them are a little wonky. <coughs> Most of them are pretty easy to figure out, but um, like some states share, share letters. Oh, gosh dang it, I need some water. So I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna probably cut this short because I got a tickle in my throat and I don't have any water with me. You look better than Fisk beard mullet. You know what? I, Fisk when he hits a hundred thousand, he's doing a a, a a a haircut. I think he promised. So that'll be interesting to see. For hundred tips from Taco, yes. So I'm gonna skim through these real quick. Uh, they look better than all the beards. And, yeah, yeah, <laughs> true. Uh, da, 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 da. have some gray like mine. Yes, gray, that's what I have. I have uh, I have salt and pepper beard. I don't have much gray on my head. I have like two or three strands of gray in 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 my hairline. My you know, but my 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 beard, my chin is quite gray now. <clears throat> hey, so I got some spotted cow or ale. Uh, spotted cow. Oh, nice. Yes. Ale Asylum beer in Michigan. Uh, I don't have Ale Asylum. We don't. We don't even get Spotted Cow. We got to go over to Illinois to get that. I think, or yeah, down to Illinois. I don't even think Indiana has Spotted Cow. Um. <clears throat> do, 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 do. You never had a hill for a friend. You know, I've had plenty of things for friends because my I my quote unquote IRL friends are a bunch of a holes. <laughs> so, uh, so in order for somebody to be nice to me, I got, I, I, you know, I have, I have a stick. I named him sticky because I'm very creative. <laughs> oh, look, taco, a rock. Oh, a rock. Millie rock. Yeah, that's, that's me. No, are you, are you mocking me? Because my, uh, my, uh, shiny thing, that is me. I'll be like, Oh, I'll start talking. And I'll be like, Oh, look at that. Where's the beef? Exactly. So yeah, make sure you, you know, whenever whenever you see Fisk, hit him with that. Where's the beef? One hundred percent. Did you have the secret trap door? Uh, did you open the secret trap door? No, you can't. Yeah, I wait. Oh, I don't know if it's later in the story. 
or if it's uh gonna be you know this music does not fit our conversation right now i'm changing that dun, 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 dun. i'm gonna dance uh but yeah i don't know if it's later in the story or if it's just gonna be later in what you know with uh some updates or dlc i'm interested to know what's in that basement though what does grandpa have hiding down I just got a few straight, th uh, thick chin hairs to pluck. Gross. <laughs> no, 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 I'm with you. I have, uh, like, uh, like my eyebrows. I have a unibrow, not a unibrow, but I have like two or three straight, like unibrow brow wannabes. So I pluck those out. <laughs> no lie. And they're thick too. They, they're really thick. So they're, they're, they, they stand out like a sore thumb when, if they do grow in. So, so it's like a little black dot that starts forming, and I can't get it yet. So I had to wait a few days, and then it's long enough for the tweezers to pluck. And then, and then a couple weeks later, I got to do it again. You know, let's discuss facial hair, <laughs> our facial tics. <laughs> now that people know more about me, now you can start drawing or painting a picture of me. You know, it was just uh, me with my uh, my freaking my wannabe unibrow. How is Doris? Doris is good. She lives her life. I don't know if you, you follow me on Instagram. Okay, if I think you do. Uh, um, check out my Instagram. The links are below. You can see, you can catch up with Doris and stuff in there. Like I put, uh, a few days ago, I put a day in the life of Doris and basically her routine. And she she's filthy. She's absolutely filthy right now because she spends 90% of her time outside. Uh, she'll get up at, at 10 in the morning. And uh, we usually open the back door so she could in the screen door uh, in the back at the back door. We don't have a latch on it so she can push her way out. And then she just lets her outside, stuff outside and then she does her routine. You know, check, check on my Instagram. You can see the see see her routine. And, and, that, and that's no exaggeration. That's that's it right there. Her routine. Um, it's pretty, pretty easy being a pig. <laughs> Last night I was sitting there on the beach with my wife. And she went down, got a drink, wallowed in the mud from the pond, and then wandered, waddled her ass up to us and laid down next to me. And I just, you know, laid there. It was fantastic, laying there in, in the, the beach chair and just pet, petting my pig, just like any normal human. <laughs> uh, awesome stream, Taco. Thanks, dude. Appreciate it. A A Anon. Uh, I appreciate you joining. One hundred percent. Thank you for that. It's, it means a lot. Anybody join in here, man? We have, we have quite a congruent viewers right now. Forty-four. You know, it, 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 more than normal. It, I, I love it. It's twice my average. I think my average is around twenty something congruent. Twenty twenty something plus. So yeah, this will be my the thing. I think I'll be doing this game a lot. I will be mixing in some other random games. I got some survival games I want to play. Um, but I'm definitely gonna put together a series for for this with the the storyline for this uh because there is there's a good storyline for this game for sure and i enjoy it plus you guys get to watch me be the apex hunter that i am and you can take all your notes no taco as an i want to brow gross <laughs> right uh ah oh, thank you mullet thank you for the link doris hams it up every day she does I want to say hams it up. She's not a big people person, people pig. Um, she loves having her belly scratched. That's about it. You know, she's not she's not a social butterfly. Um, so uh, yeah, like like uh, like the 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 donkeys and the goats can be. They're big people. They're people animals. They, they, they'll, they'll pester the crap out of you if you go into their their pasture with them just in rub up against you. Like I, I was, uh, I got distracted. I was petting the donkeys one day and then I, then I got, then I started actually working in there again, picking up you know, stones and stuff. And, uh, next thing you know, one of the donkeys put his head between my legs and lifted my ass up off the ground. I'm like, what the Kirk, let me blow. <laughs> Cause he wanted attention. He wanted to be scratched some more. How's your girl from Marina? Ah, <laughs> uh, you got the ass fist. <laughs> She's with Fisk right now. Oh, that's great. Fisk, play, Fisk is such a great sport. I love the fact. And Marina's fantastic. She's such a nice person. So sweet. Such a sweetheart. So 
So it's the best is, you know, I, I love fucking with fists so much. Well, uh, I'll, I'll hit him with, uh, go scare him or whatever. And, and then she jumps in there. Ah, oh, it's too good. Too good. Or she'll be like, I'll be like, are you home? Or I was like, uh, yeah, are you home? She's like, I can't scare Fisk right now. She'll know exactly what I want. <laughs> I love it when she's sleeping in front of the wood stove. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's wintertime, though. She doesn't spend much time inside. Uh, You know what I'm going to have to do? Because I am putting... Uh, I'll be starting next week. I'm going to start working on the cabin. The stabbing cabin. Um... And uh, once I get the pot belly stove in there, I'm going to have to somehow build a ramp because it sit, the cabin sits high off the ground. I put it um, probably about 16 inches off the ground. So I need to build something for her to be able to waddle her butt up in there with us because uh, then she'll because she'll love that pot belly stove. I guarantee when that thing's a blazing. We need a blot to post like discord. You know, I. I don't know what if you could do that with YouTube. I'll have to look to see because there is you, like I can't add. I don't think I can add like Nightbot. You know, just spam randomly. I'll have to take a look see if YouTube has anything like that. I don't know. I, you know, when it came to because I was a mod for so long for so many years, I've been modding in Twitch. The Twitch became just second nature. Bots or Nightbot mainly. There's so many bots that, that they all run differently, but. Nightbot was a cinch. So programming that was so easy. Um, YouTube is new. But I didn't want to... I purposefully didn't let myself get carried away with learning YouTube. Because I get OCD with shit. And uh, I didn't let myself. So I want, I'm kind of just running, going with the flow with this one. So there's going to be a lot of hiccups. But it's worth it, in my opinion. Because it's keeping me from being too, like I said, OCD about it. And stressing out over little things that aren't working properly. Because then I can just blame the fact that I don't know yet. You know, and I'm, I'm less less angst about it. Uh, it was a pun. Taco, shame on you. What was the pun? I missed it. Doris hams it up. Oh, I hams it up every day. Oh, oh, I took it serious. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. But ham, hamming it up means a certain thing, right? She's a, she's a social butterfly, right? So it, I took it took it for face value. So I apologize, Chris. Don't yell at me. God. I swear. <laughs> You like uh, this better than Call of the Wild? Uh, yes, Scott. I'm gonna, I'm gonna right, right now. Yes, uh, not the multiplayer though. Solo, the so the storyline, the solo play, the complexity of the game, 100%. Yes. Um, so if you're looking for a good hunting game and you're gonna play solo, and I was, you were to ask me which one should I, should you buy? Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you. Buy this one. Buy this one over Call of the Wild. It still has some bugs, but it's a new game. Um, Call of the Wild definitely has more maps, but over the years, it just felt like rinse and repeat with the maps and the stories are just so, you know, there's not a huge flow to them. It's like, go shoot this, go take care of that. Call that, do this, do that. Uh, this one, I mean, I'm new to it, so I haven't delved deep into the story yet, but as of right now, early game, 100% this for me, I'm going to say this. Why, uh, um, Way of the Hunter. God, I drew, drew a blank on the name. Way of the Hunter solo beats Call of the Wild, in my opinion. Uh, multiplayer, Call of the Wild beats Way of the Hunter. And that, that which is kind of sad because I love, I absolutely love playing hunting games with, because a, a hunting game is perfect for Fisk, Booster, and myself for a shit show because. We um, we just we blabber, right? We're doing what I'm doing right now. I, you know, subjects get tossed everywhere, every which way. It's a podcast, and with some hunting, you know, going on in the background. But when uh, we we also need some context going on too, which helps drive things. And this game is the multiplayer is broken yet, so hopefully that fixes. Hopefully they fix that. Um, fingers crossed. And we'll be able, to, you know, fit some more in later, but we'll see. We'll see. So as right now, I'm just gonna I'm gonna play solo, and then we'll we'll do some other games. So there will be some other stuff coming up with the three of us, but we're gonna find some other games to play. Um. So just keep your eyes out, keep your eyes appealed. 
you know, maybe I'll be live one time doing it, or maybe Fisk, or maybe it'll just be recordings. So we'll, we'll see. But I can almost guarantee that I won't be doing any just basic, basic recordings. Or not, I say basic. That's not basic. That's actually more complex. I'm not going to be doing recordings um, because editing, um, it's not my forte. I'm, I'm horrible. And like I said, carrying on a conversation with myself, I'm not good at. At all. Booster and Fisk are very talented when it comes to that. I'm very talented with editing. And uh, I just don't, I don't have that skill set. So, and I had actually somebody offer to do it for me, but my, I, I, I don't, I don't want to pay somebody to do the editing for me. And I, you know, I, yeah, I, you know, it's, um, you know, I don't know. It's just not my cup of tea. I, I, I want to feel like it's my content then. If I'm, you know, I'm, I'm you know, that straight, that forward, that's, that's straightforward. It's just wouldn't be my content then. I'd rather have it be hundred percent me. Unless it's artwork, you know, I'll play somebody to do artwork for me because I'm horrible. I, I'm not a very, art, I, I have an artistic mind, but I'm not, I can't put uh, uh, pen to paper, if that makes sense. I can't, I can't edit or hold convo myself either. Yeah, right. Yeah, you know, I, you know a lot of people can't. It's, it's just, you know, you know, you got to know your traits. You got to know yourself before, because there's a, there's a lot of me, I mean, Fist says it's, he calls his, his content mediocre, right? But it's, it's it's far from mediocre. Far from mediocre. Um, And there's a lot of mediocre content out there on YouTube and, you know, any other of those sites. There's a lot of mediocre content. And I don't want to be lumped in with the actual mediocre content. So I think this is where I, I thrive is interacting. IRL. But I think we're going to call it there, people. I 100% appreciate. Oh, shoot. You know what? I was going to come up with an outro. Mama Mullet sent me a great idea, but I hadn't done it yet. <laughs> so we're just going to go with a basic, basic B outlet here. And maybe this is what it'll be. I'll just be like, hey, give me an, you know, give me an outro. <laughs> you shine live. I, I, I feel like I do. You know, I hate to, I feel, now I also feel like I'm tooting my own horn, but I, I do, I feel, uh, I, I, I'm more comfortable live, which, it, you know, a lot of people aren't, you know, it, it, cause going live, I'm not going to lie. It, it, it is nerve wracking and it's very exhausting trying to read and, and know that people are watching you, especially when you're playing a hunting game and you're missing shots <laughs> and it's a game that, you know, something that you were known for in call of the wild, you know, as a, as a good hunter but i haven't played a hunting game in forever you know and i'm not a, a fps person so it, it but I, I you know it's fun i love making fun of myself i love that when chat makes fun of me and i interact well with it you know and some people can't take that criticism because they get insulted you know and that's them you know you, like i said know your strengths know your strengths know your weaknesses and play off of them and that's what i'm gonna do here so i'm just gonna do the live thing and post it live and not do any editing other than maybe throw you know the 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 timestamps in there so people can jump ahead so they, they can avoid like this banter if they if they want and they don't want to watch the gameplay but anyway see i already got sidetracked from my exit i started saying i was going to exit but then i then i freaking typical taco right <laughs> anyway hope you all have a safe and wonderful day i appreciate everybody for joining i'll talk i'm gonna steal foosters today and i'll see you in the next one